back. So February is Heart Disease Awareness Month. Heart disease is the number one killer of men and women in the United States. A lot of women die from this, and, and a lot of people don't realize that. Nutrition specialist and author of The Calendar Diet, Dr. Melina Jampolis, is here. You've got two simple tips to help every, everybody get a healthier heart. Absolutely. It doesn't have to be that challenging. You just have to be consistent. The first is to boost your omega-3 fatty acids. These are essential fatty acids. They're essential because the body doesn't make them. You have to eat them. They help control inflammation. They may reduce your risk of heart disease, help lower triglycerides, and they may prevent arrhythmias, which lead to sudden cardiac death. I take omega-3s every day. Then you're already on, right. uh, on track here, but good sources are salmon. You can even get canned salmon or sardines. If you don't eat fish on a regular basis, you can take a supplement like this one mega three uh, mega red omega three krill oil it's actually a good one because it's small easy to swallow and you don't burp fish right, afterwards. a lot of them are, ver oh, the ones are very you big and a, you lot, do sort of burp a lot fish. of my patients they complain that no matter when they tape they burp fish yeah. because that's fish oil nothing this more is... romantic than burping fish especially heart month you know you want to be romantic on valentine's day right. and you're like honey but does and, it help with your memory any of this actually everything that's good for the heart is good for the brain so that's a great question there's a lot of emerging research on the benefit of omega-3 fatty acids for brain, for mood, for arthritis, lots of great things. The other thing a lot of people don't realize about fiber, which I, I haven't really focused a lot on, but, but you say fill up on fiber. Absolutely, and this is a specific type of fiber. This is water-soluble fiber, so it actually forms a gel when you add it to water, and it binds to cholesterol and helps your body get rid of it, so it helps you lower cholesterol naturally. I had my oatmeal earlier today. So you, you guys are like rock stars when it comes to heart health. I don't, I don't need to be here. Uh, <laughs> but oatmeal... Beans, apples. apples, and strawberries, these are all great sources of soluble fiber. That's particularly important when it comes to heart health. So these two things are really the foundation of a heart-healthy diet. Mediterranean diet, lots of fresh fruits and vegetables on a regular basis, and you're good to go. And lowering salt also. Absolutely. Lowering salt, replacing it with spices, because spices are really heart-healthy. They're packed with phytonutrients, which can actually help fight diseases as well. Great advice. Uh, Dr. Melina uh, Jampolis, thanks very Thank much. Thank you. For more information, go to our website, andrewstuber.com. Everyone in the audience is going to take home some Mega Red Omega uh, 3 krill oil supplements. They'll boost your Omega 3s. We'll be right back with more of the final.